Hi, this is Martha here at my channel, Nalinka Sims. Thank you so much for stopping by today. Uh, I, I'm here with uh, Saturday Morning Makes, which is hosted by Jill Norwood. And you can participate or look for others who are participating by entering this information. Hashtag Sat Morn Makes. This is where um, uh, we crafters are coming on on Saturday to show those um, projects that we have completed, usually during the week. Uh, and of course, these uh, videos are uploaded every Saturday. As you can squeeze them in and do go by and look at all of the others, as many as you can. Today in my introduction, I have my, I'm showing some old um, pro projects from my missies, and I do have a full video on that. Um, hmm. uh, that I'll, uh, you can go and check out if you would like. Today I'm going to be featuring a technique that I saw on May May Made It. Now I really am putting a link in the description box to her channel. This is where she has taken a single sheet of uh, cardstock uh, and made six cards. And if you were to look, at, and the idea is to have busy paper, paper that you want to make cards out of, but you don't know which portion to cut for the card. So what you do is you cut it blindly. It's a mystery card. You cut it on the back side. She has an excellent tutorial on that. So that is what I'm going to do today. I'm using um, this Sizzix uh, banner dies. This um, birthday stamp. Oh, Stampendous. And this one is all, this one is Hero Arts. Okay, those, those two stamps and one from Stamping Up, this small one. Okay, then I use some Anna Griffin flowers, not necessarily these, but I empty all of my flowers into containers like this so that I can easily sort through them. Okay, so let's see the cards that I made. Let's start with this one. And here I use my Misty. Uh, to put the wishing you a happy, you know, and this is one I didn't bring out too. This is an Anna Griffin stamp here, uh, that happy birthday. And then this is the inside. Okay. This is the second one. And uh, I did put an extra Anna Griffin flower right here on the outside as well, plus some pearls. Okay, then on this one, uh, I put a, an extra flower here, pearls there, and it's upside down. <laughs> and here's the Anna Griffin sentiment stamped there using my Misty. And this is one of those stamps I just showed you and another flower on the inside. I'm going to move this over and let you see that I'm placing this back down where uh, it originally was cut from. So this first one goes here, the second one goes here, and it's going to complete this page when I'm done. Okay, here's the third one, and I used an Anna Griffin uh, sticker here, Anna Griffin flowers here, some little beads from, the, from some corsages that I had, uh, sentiment here and flower and a griffin flat flower there okay and you see the flowers and this design here well it is also on this sheet uh, this one I decided to just leave as a note card and it says the world needs who you were meant to be um, so I didn't put anything on the inside of this one. And 
This one uh, has a flower here and this bright pink here, which is really not my style, so to speak, or my favorite color uh, scheme. But with my vision being what it is, when I stamped the Anna Griffin stamp on this in my Misty, I had a piece of paper underneath and I couldn't discern the, the where this one stopped and the other one started. So I stamped off the off this page and I had to cover it up somehow. So this is how I worked that by covering it up with this. And I tried to put a flower here that sort of brought out this pink. Plus it is the same as my mat. Okay, and then this is the inside. That one goes there. And then the sixth one is the same, uh, Anna Griffin sentiment, wishing you a, a, a very happy birthday, an Anna Griffin flower, some pearls, the sentiment on this inside, and another flower. I hope you will go by and check out May May's channel to see uh, how she did this and the cards she made. It's very interesting. I want to try it again with a, a paper that is even more complicated than this so that if you were going to try to look at it and make a card, you wouldn't know it, wouldn't have an idea of where to start. But by blindly cutting it, it works. Thank you so much for stopping by. I do enjoy reading your comments. Stay safe, be blessed, and ta-da.